Welcome back to a game for your thoughts. So we're diving into Knuckles stage here on uh, I forgot the name of this place. I'm gonna be honest with you. All right, let's see. So now it's basically hot and cold, but a not very very good version of hot and cold. Oh look, it's literally just sitting right there, and the giant flashing exclamation point above my head to actually make this a whole lot more difficult than it needs to be. That's okay though. We'll make it work. Up, up, and away. All right, let's see where are we at. This way. All right. Ah, this is the way. Um, right there. No, I'm shocked. Um, where art thou? Let's see, what does this say? Four whirling eyes. Great, glad that makes sense. Um, that is a little bit more of a... Let's see here. Where Where are we heading? Where are we going? Huh? Where, where are we off to? Um, or is it flashing faster? Oh no, I've been attacked from above. Whoa, how am I supposed to fight? Yeah, there we go. I'm like, how are we supposed to fight back, man? Um, is, let's see, no, it's over here somewhere, but where over here? I don't understand. Let's see, what about up here? No, not up there. Whoa, crazy shenanigans. All right, all right. Okay, I remember as a kid thinking like Knuckles, I was like, Knuckles is so cool. And then like I grew up and I was like, he's annoying. <laughs> he's like, oh, like I'm here to guard the Chaos Emerald. And it's like, dude, you end up causing more problems trying to save the Chaos Emerald. It's like your job is literally, to, it's like, it's like the, it's like if you have like a crossing guard whose whole job is to, you know, make sure kids get across the street safely. And then like one day you're just like, eh. I won't let these kids cross and then you like let a kid get run over and then they're like why'd you do that because I had to prove the point of how important that crossing that crossing guards are and it's like that's not how you do that <laughs> you know, that's exactly what knuckles just did here with the oh look there it is right there awesome that didn't take too long two two minutes and 20 seconds Ooh, look at that we almost got 2 2020 that's awesome that was like back in February it was it was 2 2020 that's awesome I still can't believe it's 2020. Like, I, like, think back to, like, oh, 2017? That's not too long ago. Ooh, rank B. Boom. B for BAM. That was awesome. Oh, yeah. It would actually be kind of cool to have, like, a sticker or, like, a cool pin of those Sonic emblems. I mean, I'm going to be honest. They're kind of cool. Um, prison Island nearby. They don't give you enough time to read it. Like, they type out just, like, they give you enough time to type it out. And then they, like, quickly skip to the next thing. Like, you're like, Prison Island nearby space, and it's like, next, and it's like, I, I didn't have time, it's called Prison Island, wow. Oh no, Sonic. Why does Tails have Sonic's name on his plane, like he's like, I know Sonic usually stands on the back of his plane, so does he have like an arrow sitting there, and it's like, Sonic goes here, and then like, has like an arrow. Hey, it's Amy, what's up? Oh no, he's gonna go push her in the water, that's like the worst thing you could do. <gasps> Don't do that. Oh no. Yeah, don't help Sonic. He's fine. Oh, transform. Oh shit, we got Transformers going on. Robots in disguise. Oh man, Tails coming in hot. Trying to save Amy. Let's do this. I'm ready, I think. Probably. Oh, we're finding Eggman. Alright, off the bat. Dr. Eggman. He's not even looking. Alright, Jim Carrey, I'm coming for you. I actually still haven't even seen the new Sonic the Hedgehog movie. Hopefully it's good. Oh no, I took some damage. We better take on Eggman. Oh god, that was difficult. <laughs> that was so dumb. That was almost too easy, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, too easy. You, you get it, Tails. And it's like, yeah, yeah. He's like, I did it! Yay! And like Eggman's like bleeding from like the inside out and like his ship is like in fire and like he's like, I'm dying! And Tails is like, I did it! Hooray! Oh, nope, Eggman's fine though. He's like, arg! Grr! Well, hi, Amy. Nice of you to show up. Oh, man. Amy's name's kicking in. Oh, yeah. Yeah, what are you doing here, Amy? Don't you have more important things like being a girl? She's like, yeah! Oh. Oh, man. What well, What do you expect, Tails? That's literally Amy's whole character. Has she ever done anything in every any other Sonic game other than be like, Sonic, oh! But, I mean, that's what I do during all the Sonic games. So, I mean, like, Amy and I aren't that much different. Yeah! Wow. And Amy's theme song is something, isn't it? Prison Lane, find the core of the prison. Alright, we're heading into the core of the prison. 
All right, let's see. Hold down B button to lock on. Release it to fire a homing missile. I'm going to be honest. This is like the most like interesting but uninteresting gameplay ever. Like it's so like okay, I guess. <laughs> um I forgot to Let's see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I got to jump. Yeah, there we go. I forgot I could jump. I was like, oh, I guess I'll just walk across, but I can't do that. It doesn't work like that. No, no, no. Silly me. How dare I think that it works something convenient like that would be that would be bad. That would be so bad. But here we are. We got it. We're making our way through the prison. Also, this is not a very intuitive prison, gonna be honest with you guys. Uh, oh, we got a med pack somehow. I don't, I don't even know where that was at. But hey, we got it. I'm not gonna ask questions. Oh, the little chow dude told me something, but I don't know what. Is it more efficient to tap B, or is it more efficient just to hold it, walk around, scan a bunch of things, and then release B? I, I've never been able to figure out what the most efficient way of using Tails is, but also at the same time, it's been like 10 years since I played this last. At least 6 or 7 at least I can guarantee that but beyond that I can't guarantee anything of how long it's been since I played this game but hey but then that leaves up lots of possibilities of me being like hey this doesn't make any sense because it doesn't but doesn't need to make sense you know it's, do video games really need to make sense do all of them have to have like some deep and you know important meaning of like ooh, what's going on here I mean, it makes it more interesting, not gonna lie. I mean, like, Death Stranding, I spent that whole game, like, wondering, like, what the hell is going on here? And then, like, you play this game, you're like, I know exactly what's going on, and I'm not too concerned about it. Except I have so many questions. Who's Shadow? Why is he the ultimate life form? Where'd he come from? Why does he get a gun in his own game? Oh, wait, that's right, because he's dark and edgy, am I right? I think? I don't know. I know I own the game, I just try to avoid it. I am going to be honest, though, when I was trying to decide what game to play next, I almost chose Sonic 06, but blessing in disguise for you, um, <laughs> I was like, let's play Sonic 06, and then I put the game in my Xbox, and it's like, disc unrecognizable, and I was like, weird, and it gave me like some air code, and I like looked at the disc, and it was fine, and <laughs> um, I like look up the air code online. It was like air code zero three five five nine seven. I was like, okay, what's zero? You know, air code blanky blank blank blank. And then I put it in. It's like this air code shows up when the disc might be too scratched or if there's a known problem with the game. And I was like, oh, this game has plenty of known problems. Have you ever played Sonic 06? Because that game is the epitome of problems. Not their fault, but still, it has problems. <laughs> And they're very apparent. It's not hard to hide the problems in Sonic 06, I'm gonna be honest. I mean, there's like this game, and it's like, it's like, has problems, but like, they're like, okay, it's still fun and silly, but like, Sonic 06 is just not fun. Bad. It's bad, bad. <laughs> and that's fine. It can still be fun. Oh, you see that guy hanging up in the corner? Ooh. First mission cleared. Uh, this is like the second or third one. Uh, but that took three minutes, and we collect 18 out of 919 rings. But hey, we still got a C. That's like my high school grades right there. Boom. C's get degrees. Except for I don't go to college, so I can't get a degree. But that's okay. We have three Sonic emblems now. I feel like we're going really fast through this game, but I have honestly no clue how long this is. Let me just whack you back and forth in the same spot. Jeez Louise, what is all over this wall? I would love it if he's like, Amy, and she's like, shh, keep your voice down, and it's like, you keep your voice down, oh, sorry, yeah, like, what's all over the wall, did he draw all that, I doubt it, yeah, kind of rotted with tails, psh, tails, my man, also, I didn't see Amy at all in that last level, so I doubt she was running along, what is he doing, he's, oh, he's staying fit, yeah, there you go, gotta, gotta stay warm, uh, what's, what's, uh, zombie land real, 21 or whatever, limber up. It's like, you see a lion limber up before it chases down his gazelle? Lots of problems here. Darn. Oh well. Because I have to. Wow, that's an intuitive gate. Oh no! I haven't seen Shadow here. Of course, Eggman's behind this. Yeah, see, look, I'm glad she's asking the same question too. Oh, he's out of here. Yeah, there's like hard like mathematic equations on here and it's like how to be the fastest creature alive. You take the 
Okay, here's some hard math for you. So you take the square root of pi divided by the uh, mass of the sun, times that by 16, and now how many apples does Timmy have? And that's how you become the fastest thing alive. And also answer basically any high school math question. Like, those things are ridiculous. It's like, all right, use this formula, and you're like, okay. And then it like gives you like all this nonsense, and it's just like, this is ridiculous. I can't believe that this is, like... They're using this to determine everything that I will know and love from here on out, I guess. I was going to go and try and get that life, I'm going to be honest with you, but it just didn't let me. It just didn't work out for me, and that's okay. The light shoes. Light dash to move at light speed. Wow. Along paths of rings. The action window will appear near the rings. Press the B button to get them. Okay, got it. Uh, let's head on back down, I guess, and uh, we'll... Light dash through those rings next time on a game for your thoughts. Thanks for watching. Bye.